Rolly? Hi, I'm Hannah Hart and welcome to the World Record Show. If you've never heard of recordsetter.com, allow me to elaborate. It's a website where you can set your own world records. The idea being that a person can be a champion at anything. All you have to do is come up with a record, shoot a video, and post it online. Uh, for instance, right now, I'm gonna set the world record for longest time staring into a camera in a little box on the screen. Are you still here? Okay, good. Let's go check out some records that have actually already been set. Now, this first record comes to us from a nice young girl in New York City who wants to hold the world record for most times you snort in 10 seconds. Go. She held that record you know, until it got beaten by this guy. And then this guy. And finally, this guy in Santa Cruz, California. What kind of dude would want to take away a world record from a tiny baby child? Those three guys, apparently. All I know is I hope that Snorty, which is her nickname now, uh, comes back and tries again. Moving on, here is a record that has yet to be beaten by anyone. Let's check out the world's longest head spin by B-Girl Spinderella. These next records were set by a true record setter legend, Brian Pankey from Springfield, Illinois. He currently holds over 2,000 record setter world records, some of which include tallest stack of marshmallows stacked using chopsticks, longest time balancing love seat on chin, and my personal favorite, most bites taken out of three apples while juggling them in 30 seconds. You know what guys, we've been sitting here talking about records for a little while. Let's definitely check on Spinderella and see if she has fallen down yet. While Spinderella keeps on spinning, let's move on to a record that will blow your mind. It'll put you into a transcendent state where there's nothing but earth and sky and wind. You'll forget your own name. But let's just watch it anyway. This record for fastest time to complete a two ball game of Labyrinth was set by Alon Mass. Now, he also happens to be a surgeon. That is some precision that I could trust. Next, we're going to see a man fit 800 straws in his mouth. But before that, I would like to show you a record that I assuredly could never beat. This was set by Joe Salter, and it is the fastest time juggling in a triathlon. think I could juggle while sitting on a couch. Okay, anyway, time for the guy with 800 straws in his mouth. Now here's a woman who used a straw in an entirely different manner, Canadian radio DJ Mel Sampson. She holds the record for world's longest straw to drink a Coke. Uh, please do not attempt to complete this without permission from your flight captain.
Now I know what you're thinking, where's Spinderella? Let's take a look. She ended up spinning on her head for 13 minutes, 53.34 seconds, which has to be the coolest breakdance feat of all time. She's really trying to get ahead. Now, sadly, it's time to end the show, but you know what? It's been a real party. Did someone say party? Why yes, you just said it. Am I talking to myself? Anyway, no really, this guy Andrew WK sang the word party 204 times in a song while at the Record Setter Live event last year in New York City. Let's take a look. Now we don't want to uh, go too fast so that they can't keep count. So we'll take it slow, we'll throw a few uh, real easy to understand ones in there. Let's go. Party, party, I party, party. And if I party, would you party now? And if I party, would you party? said it 204 times in that song, which I personally am going to try and beat right now. If you have any other record setter ideas, feel free to tweet me at Harto and let me know your thoughts. But most importantly, you should try and set your own records. Just go on over to recordsetter.com, submit a video, and start to really capitalize off your own personal awesomeness. And now, time to take down Andrew WK. Party 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 party